Hey, my bad. I'm late. Finally, you're here. I'm Eito Kimura, a 24-year-old businessman. I switched jobs a year ago, and today was supposed to be our company trip, but I got caught up in preparations and, well, ended up making her mad again. You're late, Eito. That's why you're always late with your work, you know? S sorry. She's my boss, Sarah Ogawa, a 28-year-old who's a young department head. She might look gorgeous, but she's known as a tough boss both to herself and everyone else. As the guy who can't seem to get the job done, I'm a special target. Wow, you brought a ton of stuff with you. It's a mountain climb. You never know what you'll need, you know, Otaku. My name's Otaku Da, not Otaku. Dude, you're overdoing it for just a hike. <laughs> Chato, I think it's better to be overprepared, right, Ron? Yep. I mean, you sure that gear is going to help you? I'm good. No problem. Speaking of being lightly equipped, Lily's. <laughs> Who do you think I am? I'll be the demon king of the underworld and I'm perfectly fine with this backpack alone. Plus, I brought some underworld gadgets with me today. Hey, that's Sir Strumming. I sealed my familiar inside it. Well then, I guess it's not Sir Strumming. That's canned herring. Nah, that packaging is definitely Sir Stroming. The magic in my place is so strong, it could destroy my house. So I have to open it in the mountains. I bet you just tried to open it there and the landlord got mad at you, right? Don't try to do it in front of us. If you hold it, it's dangerous, so I'll have to confiscate it. Wh what are you doing? What? Got a problem? Ah, uh, if you really must, then I could... Hand it over. Maybe. Enough chit-chat. We're running late, so let's go. Is it really safe to go mountain climbing with this group? An hour later. <sighs> you okay? Y yeah Don't worry about me. Go ahead. But... <laughs> hey, is that... It's a bear! <coughs> Calm down. Making noise will make it worse. Yeah, we should be careful here. <laughs> yep, this isn't gonna work. Over here. Wait, boss? I won't let my subordinate get hurt. Come on, over here. Hold on. A few minutes later. Right behind us. Don't worry. In this case... Take this! <laughs> What's that? It's bear repellent spray. Good thing I brought it just in case. I guess we're safe now. Okay, let's get back to everyone. Ah! Boss! Whoa! Ah! Uh, <gasps> looks like things are going. S sorry, I'll get up right away. You hurt or anything? Yeah, I'm fine. Are you okay, Ato? I'm fine. It seems like the grass and branches acted as cushions. All right. Then let's quickly get back to the others. But I'm sure we won't be able to climb this cliff. Then let's use our phones to text him. Uh, it's not connecting. What? Why am I and you alone together if we can't get down the mountain like this? N no worries. Panicking won't help. Let's calm down. Rushing will only cloud our judgment. Uh, okay. A few minutes later. This is delicious. She seems to have calmed down. Good thing I brought all those supplies, just in case. But I'm really sorry for getting you involved. I can't believe I put my subordinates in danger. Even though I act all high and mighty at work, I should have been alone. Wait, so you didn't want to be alone with me earlier, cause... I meant it would have been better if I were alone. Protecting your subordinates is part of being a good boss. I hope everyone's okay. So, boss... You're actually pretty nice, huh? But what? Sorry, I had the wrong idea about you earlier. You trying to protect everyone back there was pretty cool. It, it's not a big deal. Okay, let's start looking for a way down. No, let's climb this mountain. 
going down could lead us to cliffs and waterfalls, making it impossible to proceed. Plus, going up might get our phones a signal. If we have a signal, we can call for help. You sure know a lot about this stuff. I grew up in the countryside with my dad and went mountain climbing a lot. So, if it's about mountains, you can count on me. A few minutes later. Watch your step. Y yeah Whoa! Boss! I caught her again! But seriously, she's been tripping a lot. Are you, like, not good at sports or something? W what's that supposed to mean? I've been focused on studying and sports weren't really my thing. Oh, that's why you're so good at your job. That's amazing. I mean, getting praised like this doesn't help. I don't want to reveal how useless I am. No, everybody has stuff they're not good at. So, if you want, we can hold hands. It's fine. I can walk alone. <laughs> uh, I can't stand bugs. I, I said calm down. A few hours later. We should start preparing for our camp soon. Huh? It's still light out. If we start preparing in the evening, it'll get dark super fast, especially in our situation. And plus, with no food, we need to prepare for the night. So let's collect some dry wood and pine cones for a campfire. All right. An hour later. <sighs> I'm glad we got everything ready before it got dark. Yeah, but I'm getting hungry. What do we do? We have nothing to eat. Oh, by the way, I have Lily's Sir Stroming. Let's not. We've got some food and cooking stuff. I mean, I'm not good at cooking, but... Aren't you living by yourself? I've tried cooking before, but my parents were like, never cook again. And that was that. <sighs> Jeez, I'll cook then. Huh? Several tens of minutes later... It's ready. This is, like, super tasty. Really? I didn't have any seasoning, so it's nothing special. Then when we make it out of here, can you, like, make it again? Huh? What am I even asking my boss for? N not that I'm forcing you or anything. Sure. Whatever. I owe you for helping, so I'll cook. Oh, thank you. It's so good. Cooking it properly would be even better, I bet. <sighs> now it's raining. Whoa, it's pouring. Let's pack up our stuff and get into the tent quick. It looks like just a passing shower. But I'm drenched. I only brought one jacket. I'll have to wear the clothes I plan to sleep in. I'm going to use the tent to change. And don't peek, okay? Why would I? A few minutes later. Sorry for the wait. Huh? What are you doing? The campfire got put out by that rain, so I'm relighting it. It's a good thing I stored some dry wood in the tent earlier. It's pretty cold in those light clothes, so warm up by the fire. There's also a blanket. Use it. Uh, thanks. You're pretty sweet. But aren't you cold? I'm totally... <coughs> See? You're cold too, right? Let's warm up together. Uh, yeah, yeah. She's so close. And there are soft things touching me, you know? Thanks for today. Honestly, you have a lot of moments when I think you're unreliable. But today, you are pretty cool. Uh, thanks. I never expected to get praised by my boss. Even I give out praise from time to time. But why are you so efficient in situations like this yet struggle at work? At my previous job, I was way more efficient than now. Then why? But that made my colleagues jealous. I didn't want to get dragged into trouble, so I decided to keep a low profile at my current company. I still put in my best effort, but I'm afraid of standing out. <sighs> You'll be alright. There's no one at our company who talks bad about people who work hard. Uh -huh. Even if there were, I wouldn't let it happen. So don't worry about shining. I believe in you, and I know you can do it. Thank you. Thanks to that, I'm feeling a bit more confident. If there's anything I can do to repay you... 
Uh, how about one thing? Tonight, could you sleep with me? Uh huh. Wait, could she mean? Well, I'm not really comfortable in the dark. I always sleep with my teddy bear. Oh, that's what she meant. Wait, she sleeps with her teddy bear? If you don't want to, it's fine. N no, it's cool. Supporting my boss is part of my duty as an employee. Really? Well then, please. So, I agreed to this, but... Mm. Can I really sleep in this kind of situation? Next morning. Ugh. Good morning, Ato. Did you not get any sleep? W well can't really say I couldn't sleep because she was cuddling me. Want to rest a bit more? I can, like, lay down on my lap if you want. <gasps> I, I'm good, really. 30 minutes later. Okay, then, let's get moving. Hey, um, could we, like, hold hands today? Huh? Don't get me wrong, okay? It's an emergency and... I can't afford to inconvenience you like I did yesterday. Got it. So, we decided to hold hands as we climbed the mountain. Along the way, we faced some treacherous paths, but managed to overcome them. Even though I've always in trouble at work, being relied upon feels kind of nice. A few hours later. <sighs> we finally made it to the top. Really? Great! Now we can call for help! Let's use our phone right away! Oops! No signal! What? We climbed all the way up here and we can't get a signal! Are we gonna wander in this mountain forever? N no we'll be okay! I'm sure we'll get back safely! So if we can't get back, are you down to live together? That's not funny! Don't wanna live with me? It's not that! <laughs> Obviously, I'm kidding. <laughs> Did you seriously take it seriously? <laughs> You've got a cute side, you know. Well, you're pretty cute too, you know that? Uh, that noise! Wait, it's not a bear, right? Don't worry, we've got bear spray. Wait, it's gone? I had it for emergency, but did I drop it somewhere? For now, let's get out of here. Maybe even if it's a bear, it hasn't noticed us yet. Uh, right. <laughs> Man, it's still chasing us. What should we do now? <laughs> Boss! <laughs> it caught up. Well, here goes. Don't you lay a finger on my boss. What are you doing? Never mind me. I can't just leave you alone. We're getting out of this together, no matter what. Ato! Uh, this is it! Ato! Hey, look over here! G guys! Is everything okay, Ato? We looked for you two yesterday, but I couldn't find you. So we called for help and came back. Looks like you're in another pickle. that I shall release the seal. You mean? I'll show you my power. Take this! <laughs> that wasn't your power. Ugh, this stinks. But this might work on the bear for sure. <laughs> Dang, it's not working at all. Why though? I get it now. Bears love fish. So what's disgusting for us is a feast for them. Their sense of smell is super sharp, and it's after this can, you see? So this might actually be your fault. Uh, it's not my fault. We don't have time for this. We need to deal with this bear somehow. Deal with it? How the heck? <laughs> it's coming. Ugh, man, this is it. Go. Woo, woo. Huh? It ran away? Are you guys okay? Yeah, yeah. Who are you? I'm from the hunting club. This here is my buddy, Hikachu. Woo! Um, nice name. <laughs> Looks like they fled in fear of mine.
like power. Uh, you didn't do anything, did you? Thanks to this little one, we're saved. Thanks. Hmm. Afterward, we head to the hospital for a checkup. The guy from the hunting club went deeper into the mountains in search of the bear. Phew, thank God we made it down, huh? Yeah, but I caused trouble to everyone. I'm really sorry. No need to worry about that. We owe you for saving us, so we wanted to say thank you. Yeah, how you dealt with that bear was super cool. We had you all wrong, thinking you were a tough and cold person, but you're actually a kind and caring boss. From now on, we're following you forever, boss. Guys, thanks. I'll work hard to get closer to all of you, too. Everyone's so kind. I can believe in them. Maybe I can show my abilities properly. All right, let's do this. After that, me and Boss was examined at the hospital. We both are pretty much unharmed and can return to work soon. The Boss used to be feared by everyone, but now she's admired. And then I started showing my skills without hiding them, and I began working hard with everyone. As I started producing results, my boss invited me for a drink. You've been doing so well lately, haven't you? Thank you. Your words help me believe in everyone. Is that so? <laughs> if I've been able to help you, I'm happy. Huh? What do you mean by that? I've fallen for you, because you've been working so hard. You were so cool when you protected me. What? From now on? I'll be making moves to make you like me. Let's start by calling me Sara. Okay, darling? Uh, even if you suddenly say that... You looking confused is super cute, too. I'll bring the special dish next time that we promised. I won't give up until you become my boyfriend. W wait a sec! You're too tipsy! Hi! It's me, Mel! Thanks for watching my channel! I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos 